fantastic world of pets, young wizard. Capital, but there's more to pets than snacks and games. They have special abilities. A good pet has eyes and ears, far more sensitive than yours or mine. They can sense things we can't. An ideal trick for any scavenger hunt. That's a bug. Well, not a bug, but it's a spelling error. Um, bug. Other. Um, nope. Um, how would we? No big deal. Um, can I make this happen again? Yes. Other, I guess. Or is there a quest thing? Quest. Um, typo in um, Milo Barker. God damn it, Barker. Dialogue. Um, uh, on, I think this is the second, on second, I believe. Um, second um, line of dialogue. Um, um, that to then hopefully they understand that um the voice says then but it is typed as that hopefully that is good submit that don't crash me please um dun 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 the dance game you use arrow keys yeah yeah thank you for submitting your idea no worries I buried metal rings in the commons and the shopping district. Want to see if your pet can find them? Good hunting! Um, okay, this quest requires you to have a pet and guide it to each goal. If you have a pet, equip it from the pet tab in your spellbook. Um, with a pet equipped, you can control it directly. Click on the pet button on the bottom left of the screen, then, um the pet mode. Playing as a pet will make certain items and objects available that weren't before but likewise, pets can't talk to people or engage in wizard jewels. Huh, interesting. Um, you can play as your pet until its happiness runs out, replenish it by feeding snacks. Now, use your pet to find those metal rings. Okie dokie, Gamma, that didn't actually speak. I make a really good voice of Gamma. And we just need to do dirt mountains. Right, let's go this way. Let's do this. Um, now that we have set um, bonuses, we just need raids and then guilds. Yeah, that would be cool. That would be really cool. Right, pet. Um, let's quickly offer snacks for happiness. We're going to go over here, um, offer, um, all of the stack, all of the stack. Oh, thank goodness. I can finally use all of my rank one snacks. It's great. It is actually fantastic. I have too many of them. They don't give much, but at least I can get rid of them somehow. Um, they give like nothing at all, but that's fine. That's fine. I have a use. I have a use for all of these bad snacks. I also love that you can put in many at a time. It's a really, really good idea. Um, this one, this one, this one. Just charging up its happiness. Just massively feeding our pet just so it feels happy. Works every time. <laughs> Works every time, obviously. Um, I love just using all of these bad snacks that I have. I don't think I'll make use of this too much in live realm. But, you know, it's interesting to have. There we go. Fantastic. Right. Um, play as pet. Let's go. Right. Let's see what we have over here. We need mounds of dirt. Dirt mounds. In the commons. This is going to be... Oh, here's a dirt mound. We found one. Look at us go. Nice. One. We can't see what our quest is, which is kind of annoying. Um, I assume they're going to be like around the place. So we're just going to look for a bit and see what we can find. Um, right, we'll go over here. Have no idea. There's one. There's one. Let's get this one. Um, finally can get rid of your frog gummies. Exactly. It's actually a really, really good, um, way to do it. Just use all of your low tier snacks. Higher ones obviously give more, but also it may not be as useful. Oh, Penny has more quests for us as well. I know this because I've already completed every quest in the game. So, theoretically, any quest that is new will have an exclamation mark over it. So we can go and complete them all. Because why not? God love these quests. Um, is there any in here? This would make sense. This would make a lot of sense. Um, 
Okie dokie. I really wish there was the pet button still, because I can't do anything. Um, I also don't know how much it is. This test run trash. Okay. Okay, Jack. Calm down. Jack Titan Blood in game. I wouldn't say that, but that's fine. Oh, Deep Mushroom. Can you collect that? No, you can't. Okay. So you can't collect Deep Mushrooms or Reagents. Good to know. <clears throat> um, can we go this way? Our pet is just running away from us. It's great. It's great. Oh, you can see other pets. <gasps> that's so cool. Oh my gosh. I love that. Holy moly. We're going to follow... That's actually really, really cool. That is probably like the best thing ever. I wonder if they see just pets running around. I bet that's what they see. I bet. Um, didn't follow the moose. Um, it's, it's all good. Don't worry. Um, don't worry. We can go like this. Um, how many have we found? Um, shopping district. Shopping district. Okay. Just a couple in the shopping district somehow. Um, let's head to the commons. Go to the shopping district. I forgot that it was shopping district and not Golem Court. Um, you're going to scare them. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Is there a quieter realm? Um, they're technically all the same. Well, we're in Ambrose if anybody wants to come and help or come and watch me. Be bad. Um, um, Right, how much happiness? Okay, we haven't actually gone down too much. Um, right, there should be a few in here. I don't know how many, but at least two. Um, so we'll just run around the back area here and see if we find any. Um, I don't think so. But you never know. You never know what we'll find. There's one. Found it. Don't know how many. Oh, we can actually see. That's great. This time we can actually see what it is. I assume if it's your active quest, you can see it. Possibly. Don't know why that didn't work before. Oh, we found a moose. We found our moose friend. Hello. What a what a cool moosey boy. Cool moosey boy. Amazing. Are we going to... We went in. Whoopsies. After you do the dirt man, can I please see um, the combat talent on the cat? Sure thing. You sure can. You sure can. I will do that again for you. Right, let's go. Let's find this mound. I think there's like one or two more to go. And then we'll go into combat again and show... That for everybody who is just joining us. Dun, 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 dun. This is the way to get back here. Always forget where it is. Um, that's Mistwood. Not what we need. Mounds, please. Mounds, please. Where is the mounds? Nope. There's at least... Oh, we can actually see the quest arrow. Why am I, why am I running around trying to figure it out when there's a quest arrow right there? I'm just really dumb, apparently. It's probably because before I didn't have one. <laughs> Probably before I didn't have one, so that makes sense. And it'll be back here, no doubt. Yep, here it is. And hopefully this is the last. Nope, one more. At least one more. Which is... where? Um, cancel his pet play. Oh, damn it. I was going to say we'd just teleport back to our character. But no, that is not how it works. That is not how it works. Where is this? Where? Oh, I'll be back in this bit here. Player's pet. Let's go. Let's go. Over here. Easy clap. Nice work. And then Milo Barker. Um, cancel pet play. Go home. Just because this is the easiest way to get back. Do, 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 do. Um, and we will head to the pet pavilion. Which is right here. Hello. And over to Milo. Kabam. Let's do this. Hello, Milo. Ah, your pet found them all. Well done indeed. You never know what you might find if you keep your eyes open and your pet's eyes too. Nice. Um, does he have another one? No, he doesn't. Um, sweet, we got a taco, a uh, funnel cake, and a lollipop. Nice, Penny. The most favorite person ever. Penny, hi. Hi again. I got all those pets safely back to the pavilion, but now I've got another problem. My enrollment application is missing. I came here all the way from Marleybone to study under the great necromancer, Malastare Drake, who's apparently evil now. And they lost my forms. 
The headmaster's office is packed to the brim with students, and I don't know what to do. Do you know if there's a registrar we could talk to? Yes, there is. I, in fact, hate him, and I wish him to burn in the fire school. Um. What? 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 Um, you just want to finish your main quest in Mushu? Fair enough. Fair enough. Mushu is a what great place. What brings you by, wizard? A registration form for Penny Dreadful? Uh, I'm afraid I don't see it here. Which means either she didn't submit one, or it has been moved to the Archivium Malatorium, where it is guarded by the Mad Wraith. We care about protecting personal information. Or it's on Headmaster Ambrose's desk and he just hasn't gotten to all his paperwork this week. Check with him before trying anything else. I bet it's with the Wraith. I bet it's with the Wraith. 100% bet it's with the Wraith. By the way, this is a new side quest, um, obviously replacing previous Penny Dreadful quests. So um, just in case you were wondering, um, they're redoing most of the first time user, user experiences. Um, we've played through the new Triton Avenue and the new pet quest. Um, and yeah. Penny Dreadful? Of the Marleybone Dreadfuls? Why, I taught her adopted parents. Wonderful students. Now let me find her application. Uh, let's see. Papers to grade, budgetary proposals. Oh, a live frog. <laughs> Duncan Grimwater's Ode to Malastair, verses 1 to 5. <laughs> ah, here we go. Duncan Grimwater is messed up, honestly. What, what is his obsession with Malastare? Can we just answer that question, please? What is his obsession with Malastare? Like, I know he's, spoiler alert, evil and all, but, like, what is his, what is his obsession? I don't understand. Stamped and approved. But I'm afraid this delay has left her rather behind in her coursework. After the fall of the death school, I moved the students to independent studies. Take this assignment to Penny. Perhaps you can help her catch up. Yes, I am a death student. I will definitely help her catch up. Um, that would happen to anybody, by the way. Um, I, s I think if you do... Also, our mana is so high right now. Can we just talk about that for a second? That's mainly from the hyper elixir. Hold up. We need, to, we need to break the game a bit more. We need to break the game a bit more. We're doing it, chat. We're doing it. What is our max mana? 1,630. Yes. Thank you, game. I appreciate this. Do we really want to just completely break the game right now? Because I kind of do. I kind of do. I wouldn't recommend doing this. I, actually, I want some... How much are energy elixirs? Uh, 250. We're going to waste all of our crowns on mana. Major mana. You know what? 175, yes. Bye. Does it go up even more? No, it doesn't. That's it. Actually, can we equip it at the same time? Maybe we can. No, we can't. Oh, that's a shame. Okay, we can't break the game anymore. But still, we've broken the game enough, I think. Nearly 2,000 mana. Has it ever been done before? No. But I've done it. Enjoy. Right, back to back to the quests. Back to the quests. Penny Dreadful, hello. My application? Oh, thank you. And independent study, huh? I just enrolled and I've already got homework. But if you're willing to help me, maybe we can get this done real quick. It can't be any harder than fighting a zombie, right? Let's see. The assignment is called Battle Tactics of the Undead. Huh. Guess we'll be fighting all zombies. Normally, it says we'd be granted access to the sealed caves. But uh, that ship has sailed. The undead are everywhere now. I think the best way to do this is for both of us to fight everything on this list and compare notes. We'll have more reliable observations that way. In other words, we're going to do all the work and she's not going to do anything. Fight lost souls, skeletal pirates, rotting fodder and field guards and then meet me back here. This quest has multiple simultaneous objectives. You can see them all by opening your quest log and pressing the arrow keys on this quest. Use these arrow keys to select the objective you wish to complete first, and the quest arrow will point you to it. Wow, isn't that cool? She's running off to Trident Avenue, so we'll go the opposite way and catch up with her later. Um, so yeah, basically, this is actually quite a lot of XP. 35. Ooh. Um, um, she's using me. Uh, this is Penny for you. She just uses and abuses me, just because I'm absolutely the best death wizard in the game. 
It's just how it works. I kind of like how they gave us a whole bunch of extra like damage and stuff while we're doing this quest just to get it done. Um, I really appreciate that. But yeah, let's defeat a lost soul. This hasn't really changed too much um, from the previous. The first one has, obviously. Um, but yeah, we're just going to cast Headless because it's a fun spell and I like it. Um, yeah. Do, 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 do. Um, but yeah, Duncan Grimwater is a bit weird. And I want to... I want more information about why he turned evil. I really do. By the way, that's also spoilers if you haven't finished Mirage. Um, Duncan Grimwater goes against you. That's all I'm going to say. I'm not going to spoil any more. It's like right at the start of the um, of Mirage as well, by the way. But no more no more is said about that. We're just going to... Can our pet do stuff? Um, let's see what our pet can do. What can our pet find today? Is there anything out here? Probably not. Probably not. It said we couldn't get into fights with our pet. No, we still do. I don't understand that. Kind of confused, but that's fine. That's fine. Just run around as your pet. Might as well. Might as well. Headless Horseman. What spell was that? This is Headless Horseman. It's a um, spell that you can get from the Halloween packs. Um, and it is also dropped by Lawmaster during Halloween time. Um, I managed to get really lucky and get it pretty quickly. Um, and yeah, it's just a really, really, really good death spell. It's probably one of the best death spells in the game. Um, right, Trident Avenue. Let's go home and go there. Easy peasy. Looks so dope. It is. It's one of my faves. One of my faves. Um, um, that's what I was saying. They're probably redoing a lot of site, um, quests to give him at least a bit of reason. That would make sense. That would really make sense. Who's Duncan Grimwater? He's the guy in Trident Avenue who um, helps you a bit. Um, and the original quest in is kind of more, more so important in the newer quest that we did previously on the stream about an hour ago, I'd say. Um, I'll show you. We're actually going to Trident Avenue. We're actually going there, so I will show you. Yeah, he's the dude that sits near where the Kraken is. He's actually moved place um, now. Um, but yeah, that's, that's him. That is him. That's who he is. I love the wee little lightning bolts that are going around here. It's really cool. They really did well with this place now. Um, so he's over here now. We have two Susies. Um, we have an Arthur and a Duncan. Um, that's Duncan, by the way. He's kind of weird. He had a bit of dialogue in there. He was like crushing on Malastir. Kind of weird. He's also down here. This is where he used to be. Um, he's been moved up here now. Um, and I am assuming once the new update has been in Life Realm, he won't be there anymore. Um, but you never know. It's also like we have two bl blads right here. The old one and the new one. <laughs> the old one and the new one. Rotting fodder. Let's do this. Really fast. Kabam. Dun, 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 dun. Um, yeah, you know, there's there's just two. Test drum is test drum, okay? It's a bit, it's a bit broken, but we love it. We love it all the same. We love it all the same. Headless Horseman. I hope you enjoy Headless Horseman. Um, because we'll be casting this for uh, basically the whole of this time. Unless there's two people and it'll be back to dinner. night. So please enjoy Headless Horseman. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. Um, and Field Guard in the Haunted Cave. We're just going to go to this one here. I love these new teleports, by the way. Really good. Really, really useful. Um, also they look dope as well. So, yeah. I really hope they add some to Crocotopia when they update that. Um, I did see someone mentioning Crocotopia updating, and I can show you some spoilers if you want. Um, or teasers that were, or really just spoilers that were put on Twitter a wee while ago. Um... Um, what is this? Um, um, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Um, here's a fly through of it. Um, let me quickly copy video address. I'm just gonna quickly check that it's okay there. 
It also has the new Crocotopia music. Um, so I will quickly put that in chat for you all. It looks so good. So good. So dope. Um, the launcher says 50% off one month. Remember? Let's go. Nice. Twitter in New Zealand? No way. Yeah, I know. Crazy, right? Crazy. Um, but yeah. That is... That is the fly-through of um, the new Crocotopia hub that they're working on. That will be in a gauntlet, apparently. Um, I think it looks pretty cool. Um, so yeah, you can just watch that and enjoy. Um, it looks super cool. Also, it has the new combat music as well, apparently. That is exclusive. Which you can kind of hear in the background, probably. We might watch it on, um, on stream in a second, once we've done this. Um, just for fun. It's kind of loud, yeah, sorry about that. Sorry about that. <laughs> sorry about that, I kind of forgot that it would be. Um, and back to Penny in the commons, let's go. Back there. Um, your pet is alright, it does, um... It does job with its 4% damage, nice. Nice. Hey, you're back! Can I see your notes? Undead weaknesses, life, magic, and soap, but they're resistant to blades, rocks, and rolled up newspapers. I had pretty similar results. Let's call this study successfully reproduced. I'll take it to Headmaster Ambrose right away. Thanks, wizard. In other words, she did nothing. Stupid penny. I wrote a letter to tell my parents that I arrived safely, but I haven't had a chance to send it. What with all the not arriving safely... Which is okay. It gave me a chance to add some stuff about Malastair. He was my parents' favorite professor and an old family friend. Why is Malastair so popular? We don't like him. He is bad boy. Did you know he once drained all the life force out of a troll to regrow a limb, then raised the troll to fight an ogre and save some students? Uh-huh, sure thing. He was a hero. No. My whole life, I wanted to be just like him. I can't believe what he's doing now. I wish... I wish I just knew why. Because he's bad, that's why. Anyway, sorry. Would you mind taking my letter to Prospector Zeke and ask him to deliver it next time he's in Marleybone? Spoilers, he actually did it because he wants to save his wife. It's a bit weird, but you know, that's how it works. Um, because his wife is sick and actually dead now, so that's fun. I sure, youngin. I'd be downright tickled to deliver that letter. I run a sort of postal service to fund my many wanderings through the spiral. Say, now that I think of it, I just came back from Molly Bone. Got a package for, uh, one Miss Penny Dreadful. You know what? How's about I trade you the package for the letter? <laughs> you, you take yours, Miss Penny, and I'll take mine to her parents. Off you go now. <laughs> Okie dokie. Fine, Penny. The more I think about Malastare, the more it doesn't make any sense. Why would someone so good suddenly turn so bad? I just wish I could ask him. If I could find him, maybe he'd tell me. I know he used to live in the dark cave before it was sealed. Maybe he's hiding out there now. I'll leave my spell book here, just in case I'm wrong, so my new friend can come help me. In other words, we need to go and save Penny. Because she's bad. Um, <laughs> was it one on one predicting Corona confirmed? No. 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 Did not, okay? It was just a bad cold, okay? <laughs> it was just a bad cold. Um, just stop the quest. Now you won't see her in the comments. Nah, we gotta do it. We gotta do it for fun. We're going to Cyclops Lane because it says to go to Firecat Alley, but that's just too far away. My fox doesn't have that much energy, okay? We're going to Cyclops Lane. Um, I would love to just not see her in, in, in the commons, but really, I don't mind seeing her because it, it just reminds me how good I am that I had to take time out of my day to save her because she's so bad. You know, it just fills my ego completely. So yeah. That's how it works. Um, also, we're trying to get the dialogue, you know? we got to do the dialogue. Dialogue is important, okay? They spent a lot of time on this. You can't just stop halfway through. That is not how completing things works. <laughs> it is not how completing things works, okay? 
stop. Um, she's still in the same place as she used to be, which is fine. She just got lost because she's bad, which is fair enough as well. Hey, wizard. I see you found my spell book. No, I didn't talk to Malistair. I should have known he'd be too smart to come here. Could be worse, I guess. At least I have these thorough reports on undead battle tactics, so I can handle the things in this cave. Huh? Oh, my parents sent me a package. You're right. Maybe it will cheer me up. Let's see. Oh, wow, pet snacks. That'd be great. If I had a pet. Tell you what, wizard. You've been amazing ever since we met. Why don't you take these snacks? Just a small token to say how much everything you've done has meant to me. Wow, you don't get the Cyclops anymore. That's a shame. What are we going to do first? Who knows? A wayward barrel, sure. Do you think you might do me another favor? You see, I work at the mill across the river. We grind lumina crystals. I was bringing in a load of raw crystals when everything went crazy. The haunting minions scattered my shipment all over the place. Can you round up some raw crystal barrels and bring them to me? I'll be in your debt. This is a collect quest, a special kind of side quest. Unlike most quests, collect quests have no quest arrow. Good luck exploring. He laughs as they say, they have no arrow. Of course you would, you rude, you rude bugger. Luckily, I've seen them previously around here, so I know exactly where they are. Um, they are this side, I believe. Especially since he mentioned the, mentioned the haunted minions, which are over here. Um, and there's one, and there's two, and I think I see three. Um, we just need to get to number three and two. Well, we'll go this way. There's another one here. Noise. Two and number three will be over this side. Boop, 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 boop. Where can we cross? Over here. Nice. And three. And we'll go back to Sahoma. Easy peasy. All lemon squeezy. Good job. Um, you remember when when his mouth didn't move? You're an OG? Yeah. It's really good that they do now. It, it, it was a bit freaky when they would just stand there blankly without moving. Oh, good. My shipment's recovered. I'll get them the rest of the way. Thank you, wizard. Um, right, all the eels. Next quest. Greetings, wizard. Thank goodness you're here. The undead are making a mess of everything, but they're only the beginning. Storm magic flows through Triton Avenue in a steady current, or at least it did, until all this craziness started. Now the flow has been diverted. It's making the storm creatures that live in the river angry. Lightning eels have swarmed up from the depths and are slithering the muck. If they aren't driven away, their electrical charge could unbalance things even more. Can you go drive some of them away? Um, no, I do not have that T-Rex mount. Also, it's way too big. I don't like big mounts generally. Um, but no, I don't. I have... The mounts I have is a bat swarm, a celestial wolf, a gulcher, a set of wings, um, a um, broom, a newfangle, a rock mount, which is one of my favorites, and a sh sharp sky ski runner. Why, why sky? I don't know. Ski runner. Um, which I don't use on stream because it destroys the quality of the stream because it's got like a, a tail of water that pops up and just destroys it. Destroys it. Um, uh, your computer just trashed, but you're back. Welcome back, Peanut. Welcome back. We are denighting, apparently. Um, um, I've had the one that everybody got when Mirage was released. The magic carpet is pretty cool, yeah. Um, at least I think everybody, it was everybody who had a membership at the time got it. Um, and back when I forgot how I got pulled from the pay. Um, or a drop. They do drop from quite a few creatures as well. Creatures, boss fights, I guess. I guess there are creatures technically. Um, but yeah, they also drop as well. Um, right, electric eel. Electric eel. Let's go and do this. Um, right. Fantastic. We still need to do the new boss. I want Dylan to come back, and we'll do the new boss with Dylan, hopefully. Unless he's still soloing it. Otherwise, we'll go do fishing. Fishing, fishing, fishing. Um, it was a boss because I haven't opened any of those packs. Yeah. 
Yeah, usually most of the weird mounts come from packs. Um, bosses, not mounts. Ah, uh, not packs. I am so confused today. Jeez. Maybe I need more sleep. Who knows? Um, right, number three. Last one. Fight me. Fight me. These guys look really cool, though, by the way. I love how they updated them. I just really love the whole graphical update of Wiz. It just looks so much better now. Doesn't look like it was made in 2008. Looks like it's more or less today's standard, which is great. Still soloing it? Oof. Once you're finished, let me know and I'll come and um, do it with you. Um, they have electric eels. Yeah, they have electric eels now. Um, Trident Avenue got a whole change. We're doing the side quest at the moment. We've already done the main quest. Um, which is pretty interesting. Um, would highly recommend it. It also feels a lot shorter than it did before. Um, but that could also be because I have A, a mount, and B, um, have spells that can one-shot everybody here. Um, but that's beside the point. <laughs> it does feel a lot quicker even though. Also, they added teleporter to this area. We've got a teleporter station there and one to the Harvest Lord and to the entrance. So that's also really handy. Well done. That should stabilize things a little. I hope it's enough. Um, better get cracking. We didn't drive the eels away fast enough. The storm magic surge lured a cracking up out of the deep. It'll wreck everything if you don't stop it. You could use this teleporter to reach the cracking. Ah, but it's broken. The rotting fodder stole its keystone. Get it back and double quick. Interesting. It was the haunted minions beforehand that stole it. But apparently now, it is the rotting fodders. Interesting. I like how they just changed up the changed up who drops it occasionally. Gotta gotta love that. Gotta love that. Um, then we'll do Blad's bugged quest, which will be fun. Um, but yeah, here's the teleporter. There's the one to the Harvest Lord and the one to the front gate, which is pretty dope. Um, we are going to quickly hop in a battle of rotting fodders. Hopefully we get it first try. Luckily, um, drop rates have been pretty decent so far for most of these quests. I'm expecting one or two fights. Um, yeah. The member code quest. Um... Um, is this the free-to-play quest? Yeah, this is all free-to-play. They haven't changed any of the, um... They haven't changed any of the pay-to-play quests yet that I've seen. They might have changed Crab Alley by the looks of one of the quests that Sahoma has later. Um, but don't... That wasn't mentioned. It was just Trident Avenue. Um, which is, uh, basically the last free-to-play area. So, yeah, at the moment, just free-to-play. All of these side quests are also free-to-play. So, yeah. Um, do, 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 do. can I show that new pet thing? Um, which one? The new will cast. Um, free to win. Yep, free to win. Free to win. Free to win, exactly. You can win these quests for free, or don't. That is also fine. I don't know if we got it first try, probably. I just decided to go on another fight. Um, I assume you mean the will casts, which I can do in just a, the next fight that we go on. I'll do it in the Kraken fight, because who wouldn't want that? Who wouldn't want that? Um, how does it work? Um, so basically, your pets are exactly the same, except there's a happiness stat. Um, you can click this button down here, um, and you can feed your pet snacks for happiness. So, for example, if we feed a taco, um, it'll increase this bar slightly. I've already done quite a bit of it. You can also feed a whole stack at a time as well, um, or as much as it takes to refill. Um, and then you can play as your pet, so they can see some stuff like, for example, there's a buried book here. Interesting. What What is this? I don't know. Don't know how to interact with that, um, but there's apparently a buried book there. Um, absolutely no idea what that's for, but yeah, that's a thing. Um, and you can run around, you can collect stuff that only your pet can see. Um, and then you can also go back to your character. Um, and he's right here. So we can go you to Sahara. You did! Quickly! There's no time to lose! Um... Now that that teleporter's repaired, you can go deal with that Kraken. Head on down, and be careful. Good luck, wizard. Um, so yeah, as you can see down here, we don't see that buried book that we saw with our pet. It's completely hidden, which is really cool. Really, really cool. Um, and then if we go into this fight here with the Kraken, um, I'll show you that this pet, because it has one of those cards, 
can um, cast at will its spell. So over here, we have an extra spell, which cannot be enchanted. Everybody's been asking that. It can't be enchanted. I click on the enchant and then the pet card can't be enchanted. But we can um, cast it at the Kraken and that will be the first spell that's cast. Uh, the second spell, so second and then first we will just do the blade to start with. It will use the blade, but that's fine. The Kraken is moving. What? I know. Crazy, isn't it? Crazy, crazy stuff. But yeah, so we cast the blade first and then our pet will um, cast its spell, which looks really, really cool. Um, it does its wee little cast spell out in the open. And then a black cat comes out. And kabam! Does 150 damage. Nice. And then our pet gets happy. Um, yeah, and then you can do it again in two rounds. So you can't do it instantly, but yeah, in two rounds it can cast it again, which is cool. Can you still crit with pet spells? I believe so. Um, I haven't tried that out. I don't have high crit, so... Um, I'm not sure, but it does use your blade, so I assume it also uses your stats. So I assume there is a chance to crit it as well. Um, I haven't seen that as of yet, but then again, my crit isn't particularly high. It's like 30% max. Um, so yeah. And bye-bye Kraken. There we go. Nice work. Easy peasy. And then we can go back to Sahoma. Got an Ashen Cloak. Interesting. Um, Sahoma, hello. I saw the whole battle, wizard. Masterfully done. We got the beast at bay. Now I hope we can get the rest of our trouble sorted out. The storm mill is in trouble, and I need your help. Something strange is going on down below us, and we don't know what. You might not know this, but we collect magical lightning here, and store it in the storm batteries buried far below the mill. The storm batteries are in tunnels that were once beneath Triton Avenue. But now they're located right off Crab Alley. I need your help to take a look down there and see what can be done. Here's a water breathing potion. Go to the edge of the river, near the anchor rope, and jump down to Crab Alley. Find Ermin. He might have an idea about what's going on down there. I'm interested to see how far this goes because it might be changed. But this is the um, quest to go into Crab Alley. This looks like the spot. Next stop... Crab Alley. Oh, Grandmother Raven. Oh, God love it. I mean, the narrator, not Grandmother Raven. <laughs> um, and then Herman. I, I hope this hasn't changed. Welcome. Oh, it is good to see a wizard in these strange times. I think that's it. Yeah, okay. So that is just, and that is, goes straight into um, Crab Alley. Um, so the rest of the quest, which I've already done on this character... Um, and there's walkthroughs of it everywhere on YouTube that you can go and watch because it has not changed. Um, but yeah, Blad is over here um, with a weird quest. Something is going on down in Crab Alley. The water pressure is going mad, lowering and raising unpredictably. Could you go down and take a look? Speak to Herman near the entrance. He should have an idea what's happening. Here's a water breathing potion. Head to the anchor rope at the edge of the river through Triton Avenue and climb down. This is the one for Waterworks. Um, we, D Wizard City, Tug, um, Co. 1, 001A. Interesting. Except I also find it really funny that you talk to this guy, but it's this guy that talks. Um, he's the old one. This is the new one. <laughs> I assume this quest is pretty broken. Or at least um, it hasn't been fully implemented. Yeah, this is the this is the Waterworks dungeon, which is level sixty. I assume nothing else will have changed. Um, but we'll just you go drink oh. the water breathing potion and make your way down to Crab Alley. Yeah. Okay. Um, interesting. Welcome. It's been a while. Nope. I was just down here just before. And then it goes into the Waterworks quest that I've already done. What does Susie want? Uh, I'm glad to be free of the Harvest Lord. He said he was going to steal my soul. You stopped him before he could, but he needed some of my possessions to do the ritual. He sent his minions to bury my Athem, Spellbook, and spell deck in mystically resident places. Whatever that means. I don't think I could find them, but maybe your pet could sniff them out. I really need to get my stuff back. Will you help me? This quest requires you to have a pet and guide it to each goal. If you have a pet, equip it from the pet tab in your spellbook. 
With a pet equipped, you can control it directly. Click the pet button on the bottom left of the screen. Then press the pet mode button. Playing as your pet will make certain items and objectives available that weren't before. But likewise, pets can't talk to most people or engage in wizard duels. Talk to people or talk to most people? That is a big difference you there, Gamma. You can play as your pet until its happiness runs out. Replenish happiness by feeding the pet snacks. So yeah, that goes over the pet play, which we will do now. Um, and find the buried book, which we know exactly where it is. It's down here. The quest arrow was being a bit weird. Um, I might change my pet over as well, but we'll see. Here's the buried book. Um, the Athame is somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. Somewhere. Um, yeah. So this is, this is pet play. Um, and that gives a very good overview of it as well. And a quest. I like how there's quite a few times where they're reinforcing this as through side quests which is really cool i'm assuming in the next world sorry i've got a bit of um hiccups um in the next world there's going to be a lot of um this pet place sort of stuff i'm assuming um because i think it's a cool feature you know finding things that only your pets can find they are slower but you know that's the thing you could also just go and get your um your wizard to do it as well good peto and then find the buried athame is probably in this wooden chest here no it's not but we're gonna see if we can get it i kind of want to know because it says that a pet has a chance to get extra stuff from things and i don't understand <laughs> don't understand what that means um because our pet has um gold rusher your pets can only have one adventure pet power may find bonus gold in chests and I don't know what chests mean because we can't get wooden chests unless they mean silver chests or another type of chests. I'm unsure. Um, I don't want to be pulled. Hopefully we don't. Where is this? Don't know where this is. Um, yeah. They're going to make mounts for pets. Nah, I doubt it. I doubt it. Because you can't actually access your backpack. So I highly doubt that they would do that. But we can go back to our character who is somewhere maybe possibly the um you kind of go invisible um and you can't go back once you've done a lot of this um you can't go back we have pets here look at all these pets three of them wow um there you sometimes there's a button and sometimes it just disappears um and i don't quite understand where it goes but it goes um and you have to go and find a battle or go to the character select menu to get out of it um don't quite know why um but we're just gonna get into this mode if you go into a fight your character will spawn back in it's a bit weird i think that's a slight bug um 150 will blade sure um yeah What's the little thing below the friend button? That's, um, reporter bug. That's just for test drum. Just for test drum, that's the reporter bug. For example, you can't get the menu to go back to your character, which I have already reported, um, as a bug. So, yeah, that's a thing. Let's, some um, switch pets as well. Let's go to, um, this one. Because, theoretically, we should have the exact same amount of chance to get, um, this as well. Our pet should be able to find it no matter what they are um 103 102 101 we're just gonna zoom zoom over there real fast um don't know where this is don't know where this is might be over here probably is um yep there it is buried deck here we go nice and we can go back and head to Susie. Um, best way, probably go to Harvest Lord to go to the teleporter. Just because that's a thing now, which is so nice. So nice. Um, I have to keep fleeing to rework your strategy. I'm not surprised. He is quite difficult. Um, I'll come and help you if you want um, in a bit. Um, once we've finished this side quest here. Once we've finished the side quests, once we've finished the side quest, not side quests, hopefully there's not more than one, but you never know, there might be. Um, overweight, thank you for the follow, welcome. 
Thanks, wizard. It would have been hard to replace these. I hope I get to work with you again, just under less apocalyptic circumstances. Right, let's do the final side quest. Duncan. Now that things are calming down, I hope to go back to investigating what brought me here in the first place. A massive surge of death magic. The haunted cave is a powerful nexus of death magic. It could be the source of all the undead troubles plaguing Wizard City. The rotting fodder and scarlet screamers kept me from reaching the cave before, but with your help, I think I can make it. The cave is across the river at the far end of Triton Avenue. Let's go investigate. Okay, um, so this is this is actually recorded after the stream that I did that you've seen all of the other side quests for. Um, it's been a long time since then, it's about two a week and a bit. Um, but yeah, basically this is a new quest that they've added um, into Test Realm, which is still up by the way. Um, it should still be up by the time uh, this this goes live. This video which is tomorrow my time tomorrow my time so yeah should be up hopefully still by then i don't think it's going to be going to live yet there's still a couple of things that they need to fix out um but yeah so th there's no, it's not live there's no face cam but we're just doing this last side quest just because it was added i believe this is the last one um heavy iron gates once barred entrance to this cave but it looks they have been torn open from within great dialogue that is not there um, that'll probably be fixed. <laughs> I say probably. I hope it would be. Um, but you never know. It may not be. Um, so yeah, let's talk to Duncan. Hello. You made it. Good. I was right. The haunted cave is open again. It's been sealed for decades. This certainly explains all the undead. Who could have done this? Malastare helped cast the spells that sealed the cave so long ago. If only he were here. I'm sure he'd fix it. I know you think Malastare's behind this, but that's just impossible. Someone's impersonating him. And we need to find out who that is. Those field guards. I can't beat them. But if you fight them, I can examine their auras. Maybe I can see who summoned them. Good luck. Um, right. So, still a pathetic, whiny little person this Duncan is. He hasn't changed much. Um, luckily... Uh, we get to fight him at the end of the game, which makes everything so much better. We're just going to put in uh, a Dear Knight as well. I don't know why my deck is suddenly cleared, but hey, that's fine. We need to defeat, what, three of these guys? Um, I apparently don't have quest help for this quest. Um, this quest doesn't seem 100% finished. It has only just been added into Test Realm, um, as of last week, I believe. Um, and it wasn't here on the first day when I was doing all of the stream previous to this Well, basically everything you've seen in this video so far. So, um, yeah I don't know why that wasn't added to start with but you know test drum be test drum and that's fine um, Also, no quest arrow was kind of odd I'm gonna see if it has Turned off my quest helper is off. That is weird. That is really odd. Don't know why that happened Game B broke but that's fine. Right, one down, two to go. Luckily, this isn't too big a deal. Um, they're not too bad, which is good. They're just field guards. I mean, Trident Avenue, not too difficult. It's just Trident Avenue, so yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm actually looking forward to all of these quests. I think it's going to spice up the area a bit. I really like the new main storyline, which I showed last week um, in a video of Trident Avenue. I think that's really cool. I think it's slightly faster than it used to be as well, which is really, really nice because Trident Avenue did drag on just a bit, in my opinion. Um, so yeah, it'll be good now that it doesn't. It also, it could just be because it's new. I feel like it takes less time just because, you know, I haven't seen it before. I'm more invested in the story. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed the new story. Most of these quests are pretty decent, I would say. Um, so overall, I would be... I am very happy with the... Um, the uh, the revamp of Trident Avenue as a whole. I think it's been really good for the growth of the game coming into the future. I hope they do the same for uh, Cyclops Lane and Firecat Alley, but I don't think it should be progressed too much further. You did well fighting those field guards. They're even stronger than I thought. And I saw something dire in their auras. They're minions of Lord Nightshade, one of the darkest tyrants in history. He was sealed in this cave ages ago, but now he's free. There's a tower deep in Haunted Cave. Someone must have broken its seals and freed the Harvest Lord, Rattlebones, and Lord Nightshade. If we can get closer, I may be able to sense echoes. 
use of the ritual that opened the tower. Let's go. Okay, this is interesting. Um, I don't quite know exactly where this um, quest, nearly walked right into a fight there, where this quest fits in with the rest of the Wizard City storyline. It would be very interesting to know. Um, because at the moment it seems like it's touching toes on the end of it. Which, you know, could be possible. Um, but then it would also, also kind of not because it doesn't explain um, the other two, Alakane, who I guess kind of has a resolution there. Um, in his own area in Firecat Alley, and then General Achilles, who I guess comes from the Dark Cave and not the Haunted Cave. I don't know though. This can't be. I can sense the portal and the spell that opened it. I'd recognize the magical resonance anywhere. Malastare. You were right. Malastare's alive, and he's turned on us all. He's trying to destroy Wizard City. But why? I've got to warn Malorn. Or acting Professor Ashthorn, and then, I don't know, what can we do? What can any of us do? Um, and that is the end of the quest. So yeah, that is gonna wrap up all of the side quests in the game so far. There's no more in the world. Um, so we have done all of the new side quests. I hope you enjoyed this. Sorry for an extremely long video, but I thought instead of just splitting them all up into different parts, might as well just do one big video of all of it together. Um, hopefully there were some that you enjoyed. Let me know down in the comments below what your favorite side quest was out of all of these. Thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like and subscribe. If you've already subscribed, press the wee little bell so you know exactly when I post another video. And remember to craft outside the box.